Yep, you were right. It oh, it's a big one, dude. Oh my god, it's a big one. Did he eat it? Yep. It's a dinkster. It's a Damn, right behind you. That's a giant, dude. We're not even waiting for the thing. <laughs> It, dude, oh my lanta! He about took the rod out of my hand. Did you see that? He's tiny, dude. He's miniature. <laughs> dude, I don't even know what happened. <laughs> Holy, he just swam full speed at it and took both hooks in the back. No wonder he felt like he was 18 pounds. There we go. Well, I don't know. I mean, I think eventually we could work all of it. I mean, it'll be easier to pass if I go to the other side of it. I'm good with either, man. There we go, guys. First pass of the trip for me. A true huge giant. As you can tell by my Mike Iconelli reaction. Out on Lake McConaughey and he, oh, crushed it. He got, oh my gosh, it's a nice little smallie. I just had one follow too, we almost doubled. He ain't very big, but he is a small jaw. Yeah, I'm gonna throw him in here. He ain't bad. He fell off. Oh, he landed in the net. Yes. How about it? There we go. All right, first one that actually ate it. The other one I snagged. I gotta weigh this thing, Nick. Yep. You crazy man. Nick wants to, to weigh everything here. What do I do? Hit the center button. These small mouths are beautiful. All right, guys, we're leaving this lake. We're going to another one. We caught a few here, some white bass, and of course, Nick's trophy, trophy carp. All right, Nick caught this giant carp. You want me to? I got a tape in my pocket. See how long he is? Here, yeah. About 33 inches. <laughs> Look how big. I think you ought to mount him. Look how pretty they are, though. I mean, they are a pretty fish. Uh, Since they're a bottom feeding slime. Can you imagine bucket. if they would eat a freaking crankbait? Oh my gosh. <laughs> so we're going to load up real quick. There's a bunch of lakes around here, so we don't got to go very far. So here we go. Lit up. <laughs> I mean, crushed it. This is a bass. It's a good one. I don't know where you're. I have oh, no. Yeah. Idea. I have no idea where you're. Look netting. at how these bass are built in here, by the way. Oh, they're square up in the north. That's a nice large. He's fatter than heck. Look I don't how know green where, they are. I don't know where you put your. Uh, what do you call it? Your net. Where's your net? Oh, here's a log right out here for him. Be a bad one. 
jig on it. We got a jig here somewhere. Yep, you were right. It oh, it's a big one, dude. Oh my god, it's a big one. That is a big one. <laughs> Had to be. Dude, there's another one with him yeah. right there. Dude, I got my shit in the way. Oh my gosh, dude, that's a toad. Four. <laughs> Look how fat that one is. Holy crap, it's like 14 inches long. <laughs> dude, give me a picture of that, would you? Four pounder. Here we go, guys. Four pounder on the jig. There's one. I don't think he's very big, but he's there. Oh gosh, he's a good one. Run the knocker. He ain't huge, but he's a pounder. There we go. He's been caught earlier today, I think. He's got a sore lip. Get over there. What an idiot. Look how chubby he is. Here we go. A little pound and a half here. 32 pounds. He ate the slob knot out here in the deep water. I got one. Just a wee little guy. He's a wee little guy. He's our wee little guy. He's another pound and a quarter, pound and a... He ain't a pound and a half. Just over a pound on that little dude. <clears throat> this lake right here, we've got, you know, a gradual drop in the depth here out from the bank super shallow obviously on the bank and then gets deeper out here probably i'm fishing out and nick's kind of fishing in and um i've caught two in this last little stretch here fishing out this is a a berkeley slobber knocker half ounce i don't know what color this is but it's kind of a just kind of a green pumpkin with it's a little white on the bottom and then I got a Berkeley The Deal green pumpkin trailer on there. Just throwing it out there and kind of wind it, pause it, start it again. Sometimes just straight winding it. That fish, I didn't even feel him. Just got heavy. It's kind of thought I was in some grass. And there is a, a lot of grass out here, but there is some grass out here. <laughs> How can he not eat that? Probably because I'm standing over here yelling at him. Oh, he's way over here now. He left the bed. See him? He's just like, gosh, can a guy get any sleep around here these days? He's right there hiding in that, right, right, right over the top of him right now. Dude. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, he smoked it. <laughs> yes. My man. He's fired up. Oh, he's a good one. Dude, I couldn't have hooked him any better. Look at that. Dude, he slurped it in. <laughs> Here we go.
Two and a quarter. That's a good one. Yeah, he looked like a one pounder to me in the water. All right, there we go, guys. Caught that dude on a little jerk bait right off his bed. He's pissed now. We saw the Royal Lake gnats. Yep. We've seen the pipe, we've seen the largey. Almost had a giant. Got something. Is that our first I think it is a little brownie. Yeah. Yep, it is. Don't come off, dude. On a square bill. Oh, gosh. Yeah, we better net him. He's barely hooked on the back hook. All right, buddy. Been the old bear claw. <laughs> dude, he's freaking fighting son of a gun. Heck yeah. Oh, yes. Nice work. Little guy on the square bill, first small mouth on this lake. Dude, look at that spider. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Using <laughs> wilderness to fend off the wilderness. Slapped him off with the, with the fish. One and a half. There we go. Little small jaw. Square bill. There it goes. You need a net ski? That's a nice smallie. He looks a little bigger. A little bigger than the one I hauled in. And then Francis case two pounders. Yeah. <laughs> That's a kicker up there, dude. I knew I had it's like whew. Here we go, Nick caught another one. Something just Rocked it. We need a flurry of fish to get our get us up over 50 pounds. This is a pretty sad day of major league fishing. We were at 39.82 before this. <clears throat> yeah, but you got to take out the 15 pound carp, dude. Why? That's fish we caught. <laughs> what that one weigh? 185. Just a hair more than mine. That's a stick. Come on, I didn't even reel. <laughs> Dude, them freaking, oh, chatterbaits, dude. They like, that's the smallest fish ever, dude. Look at him. You wanted it. Look at him, he's half the size of the bait. He's got hooks everywhere in his face. You asked the genie for a small mouth on a top water. You didn't say what size. How do you unhook this guy without dying? Dude, he's hooked into a U now, <laughs> look. Like his mouth is stapled close. Like it's stapled through the bottom and through the top. Dude, stop and I'll help you. Yeah, quit it, you idiot. There we go, guys. Look at that. South Dakota machine. The beast. All right, guys, that's gonna do it. Uh, we did all right. We caught some large mouth, some small mouth. Uh, fished a couple different lakes and uh caught a pretty good one here caught a four pounder uh we would stay out a little longer but we forgot our charcoal so if we want to eat supper we got to go get some before the stores close there's not a lot of uh, stores up in this area and um so we got to get some stuff before we before it gets too late so thank you so much for watching if you're new to my channel make sure you subscribe hit that little bell down there so you don't miss anything we'll see you next time